Uh, hi everyone, this is a kind of small Dollar Tree haul. Um, I went there uh, Tuesday, which was Valentine's Day, and the place was really, really wiped out. Like, all of their Valentine's Day stuff was pretty much gone. There was like, uh, maybe a couple packs of stickers and like two rolls of ribbon. It was destroyed. And like, their stationery aisle was really wiped out. There are only a few notebooks. There's actually one new design that I saw that was neat. Um, just like, all the aisles were wiped out. It was really weird. It was like, snow apocalypse wiped out. But, I did get another one of these, like, uh, tote bags. It looks like a woven bag. I like them. So purple. I found a book there called Venomous by Christopher Crobatin. So it says, Locke Bonetti has an anger problem. He calls his anger the venom, and ever since he was eight years old and mangled another kid's face in a fury, he's been something of a legend and a loner because of it. But this all starts to change on one um, fateful night when Locke meets Renee. The beautiful, messed up goth girl of his dreams. She could be Locke's chance at a real relationship. His one opportunity to put his anger behind him. There's only one problem. The Venom has no intention of being left behind. And it says that um, he's a hero in the tradition of Holden Caulfield in this little blurb there. So, um, hopefully it'll be good. Kind of like how it sounds. I like the cover. It was a dollar. So. Um, I got a pack of the peanut butter pesto nuggets as usual. They have these little umbrellas at the counter. It's just a basic black umbrella. So I got that. Doesn't like, say how big it is, but I'm sure it's just a small one. I got this little nail clipper keychain. It has like kind of things you can clip it on your keychain. I'm just gonna keep it like on the inside pocket of my bag. Um, because a lot of times at work, like I end up chipping the sides of my nails off because if a can or something comes down the belt and hits my nail wrong, it chips it off. And then I'm stuck with a jagged nail for the rest of the day. So I think that'll be helpful. I got this Enemans All Butter Loaf Cake Scented Candle. It smells really good. It does smell like a pound cake type smell. Um, I don't know why they call it a butter loaf cake instead of just saying pound cake. But whatever. They also had like a lemon one, but it was too lemony for me. And they had an apple one, but it wasn't very scented. It was kind of odd. I was disappointed because I really, really wanted it to smell like a nice, like, apple crumb cake. But, I don't know. So I got one of those for me and one for my mom. And then I got a little box of the Tylenol Extra Strength. It has, like, three of the little, um, two packs in it. But I ended up getting these before our actual shopping trip because I was going to um, the doctor's and I stopped there beforehand and got those because I was in a lot of pain. Um, more and more back after. I got some Tartar Control Cat Treats for Guardian. These are the Cat Cafe brand and they're chicken flavor. They are calcium and rich for strong bones and teeth. No corn, no wheat, no soy. And she loves them. Which is good and they're good for her little teeth. Um, I also got her a pack of the Meow Love, which is like the pink package ones that they have. And she really likes those too. But um, they're not in the video because I'd have to go in the cabinet and get them. And if she hears the cabinet, she's like on the couch staring at you, like, yes, human, hand over the cookies, and then if you don't, you get followed by a cat forever. Uh, I also got her 
premium cat food. Um, I'm not sure if this cat is happy or scared about it. Or just like, kind of meh. He's just kind of there. Um, it says to compare to Purina Cat Chow, and we get her Friskies usually, which is made by Purina. Um, but it's not, there are like no cat food sales at any of our local grocery stores this week, and she's just about out. I figure I'll try this one. The pizza sort of looks like her usual food, so maybe she won't notice. Uh, I'll see how it goes. This one's a 14 ounce bag. And I found two of these Fingers Edge Fashion Nails. They're like big nails. So this one says Hottest Trends and it's um, white with black tips that have like a silver line under the black. You get 24 of them. And... It says you need to apply it with glue, um, but it doesn't come with it. And then this one also has 24, and it's like a pink vapor print pattern. They also had another one that was uh, white like this one that had just the tips that were colored. It was like a blue floral pattern, I think. Um, but it was a girly nails one, so it was like a little kid's one. Um, and that one actually had the stick-on tabs in it, which I like better. So, see how that goes. And then I just got two of the toilet paper for the house. And I got an uh, 8-pack of the little Butterfinger bars. So, that is everything that I got today. Um, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, and thank you for watching.